Welcome back to another episode of House Flipper. I call this minimalism. Look at this. My office is nice and clean. There's nothing in it. This bathroom is still a nightmare. Guys, I've done a lot of work in the house that I recently just purchased. Here, let's go check it out. Go to House After the Flood. Now, if you'll remember, this house had a bunch of flood damage all around the outside of the house, all around the inside of the house. There is a bunch of junk, which I've since located to the uh, yard, <laughs> as you can see. I might, I might end up, like, selling every last bit of this. I mean, some of these chairs are salvageable. Anyway, let me show you guys what I've done inside. Um, I believe I showed you that I took down all the walls, okay? Um, I put up some more walls. This is bedroom number one, not complete. Bedroom number two, not complete. Bathroom, not complete. This, however, is the kitchen. Ooh, the grand reveal in the kitchen. Guys, I love you know what? I love this kitchen so much that I actually showed my wife. <laughs> and she was impressed. She's like, hey, we should change all of our fixtures from black to gold. Uh, but yeah, I think it looks fantastic. I got a little shoe rack over here. These shelves are just not... These are temporarily placed. Look at this beautiful painting. Okay, so here's the idea now. When you come inside the house, there's a whole lot of space right here. So I'm thinking a nice rug here, or like a runner here would be great. And then we'll have like a hutch right here. And then here we'll have the couches probably maybe we'll have the couch facing this way tv on this end and then a little tiny dining table i think is probably a good idea to have what about something like this now does the game take into account that this is like a bedroom piece of furniture and so will it think that i'm trying to make this a bedroom i just want something here in the entrance probably a mirror up there would be great as well uh let's see mirror mirror i love searching for mirrors Oh, the de demon, demon mirror. Can we make it in gold? Oh, there we go. Perfect. Guys, this is a nice little entrance uh, area here. Now, where's that rug? I need a runner. I'm going to put stuff on the dresser eventually. Anyway, can I type in runner? Ooh, that's definitely not what I want. Uh, floor coverings? No, this is like the carpet. We need to look for like decoration or something, right? Yeah, any of these will work really, but I think maybe a nice light colored one medium size should we go with white blue is there any like light and airy colors not really all these colors are pretty intense you know i hate that i'm always oh this is probably too big right this is probably too big i think i want something smaller i hate that i'm always using like these whites and grays the next house though i promise to challenge myself with color this is kind of what i want here should we center it on the on the thing probably and then try to center it on the entrance. Oh, this is fine. Something like this is fine. Okay, let's get, uh, I guess, a little tiny dining table. I love this table. I don't like the chairs. However, we recycled the chairs. The chairs were out here, and now they're in here. I think I think these chairs are going to work nicely. I mean, we have to save money where we can. I need now a rug. A round rug. I'm looking at this one-ish. How big is this? Oh, wow. No. Definitely something a little bit bigger than that. Um, let's see. Let's see. You know, the Steam Workshop, my friend XB Crafted, you, you might know him, uh, has told me that there's a bunch of Steam Workshop add-ons and stuff that you can add to this game, and I think I'm going to do that for the next house. For this one, we're going to deal with what we've got. This is not the one either. This one, like, the, the designs on these are so hideous. Like, this dark yellow, this orange design, like, this is, no, that's too small anyway. Okay, we have to find something slightly bigger. I wanted round, but I might have to settle for... Oh, wait a minute. Maybe... Oh, no, this is the one I tried before, right? Super small? Yeah, it's only $19.99 or $19.35. Rug... Ra oh, here we go. How big? Mmm, too small, I think. I think we need something slightly bigger. Okay, so I got a little carried away. I moved the table over here because there was a whole lot of negative space here. This might be kind of an awkward setup, but I don't mind it at all. It gives us a little bit of walking space here. I feel like this should be a little closer. Oh, but you know what? Then it won't be centered with this. That's okay. We'll leave it like that. I think this room is pretty much done. I know I can put some stuff over here. Maybe like a little shelf or something. I don't know. Maybe one of those uh, one of those shelves that go behind the couch over here. I don't know, but I think it looks pretty good so far. Uh, the lighting, I think I'm going to leave the lighting, guys. Again, our goal here is to make some cash, and that isn't centered. Uh, I wish there was like an auto-center button or something. Anyway, this looks decent enough. Oh, yeah, these shelves. I could probably use them. You know what? Maybe just like three. Oh, or back here. Hold on, hold on. So we'll do one here. 
We'll do one there. We'll move this one up a little bit more so it's kind of like in the middle. And then we'll move this one over here. And then we can put some stuff on here. I'm not sure what just yet. Looks pretty lined up. Looks pretty good though, right? I think it looks pretty good. On to, I guess, the bedrooms. Now, this room needs to be painted. Oh, here's a question I had. Out here, not like you guys are going to be able to tell me because I don't think I'm going to be able to... Well, maybe I won't sell it just yet. I don't think I'm going to be able to, to get through this completely. Um, oh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, yeah. See, if I paint the whole house, it's going to match. Like, it won't have these lines anymore, right? It'll just be like a flat white. I kind of like the lines. I like the siding on it. I don't want to remove the siding, but if I paint it, the siding is going to be gone. So I'm in a little bit of a conundrum. Anyway, let's work on the inside of the house for now, and we will work on that later. All right, I got to paint this room. Oh, this light can stay. Bedroom number one is complete. Oh, did I show you guys that I put this little glass stuff in these books? It's just a little minor detail. But anyway, bedroom number one. Boom. Let's walk in here. Look at this. You guys thought you guys thought that there was not enough room in this room? Well, guess again, suckers. Also, I think I'm going to put... I don't know how the game handles the heating situation. <laughs> so, um, yeah, let's do a small radiator here and we'll just put it... Oh, wait, I can't buy the radiator before I, I buy the install pieces, right? I gotta, I gotta get like, I suppose just heating for assembly? Yes. Okay. Radiator plumbing system. That's $560. Okay. Well, this is the small one, right? I think this is the small one. It seems like this is the small one. Here, let's do that. It's fine. Yeah. This is what we'll do. You can buy a radiator mount to here. That's what I was planning on doing. So let's go with heating, radiator. Uh... Oh, wait, what just happened? I don't know if I bought it twice. Did I buy it twice? No, I don't think so. I don't think so. Everything's fine. I mean, yeah, like I was saying, I don't know how the game handles like the heat situation. If if customers or clients or whatever, uh, potential buyers are going to see it and be like, oh, there's no heating in this house, so I'm not buying it. But anyway, this room looks pretty good. I love this painting here. I'm pretty sure it's not supposed to be sideways, but it looks pretty good regardless. I did the wallpaper in the back. I went with the gold lamps with the black lampshades. Ha, huh, you guys thought I'd go with white. We got the beach dressers and the, or sorry, the beach side tables and the beach dresser. So everything kind of matches. Um, yeah, there's not a whole lot of detail happening here, and this light isn't exactly the perfect light for this room, but it is kind of black, right? Matches a little bit. Let's move on to the next room. It's really dark. This, oh, I feel like maybe we need another one of these lights. I wish there was a way to right-click or something or middle-click, and then you'd find out what exactly this light is so that you can buy the exact same one. But uh, it doesn't look like that's the case, so we'll have to go looking for it. The next thing we're working on... I put the light up, by the way. It looks a lot nicer. It looks nice and even and stuff. The next thing we're working on is this bathroom. And I have a sneaking suspicion this is going to be very, very small. <laughs> um, how do I even go about doing that? Bathroom fixtures. Here we go. The corner shower. How does that work exactly? Oh, wow. Look at how big this is. Eesh. Guys, I think we're just going to have like a tub and shower thing in here. I think the tub will probably fit. Like something like this. Oh, oh boy. Wait, can we have it at the window at least? I think it might fit here. We just got to get the installation pieces. This is going to be interesting. I might have to take down a wall. Or this room might have to be brought over just a tad. It's not a big deal. Not a big deal. Just a slight adjustment. Oh, but then how is that going to affect the doorway? <laughs> this is going to be interesting. Not going to lie to you, I'm pretty proud of the job I did in this bathroom. It looks like I was able to make it work without any configuration, right? You're absolutely correct. And how did I squeeze all that stuff in there? Very beautifully. Check this place out. Huh? You got your toilet, you got your bath, your bathtub, you got your sink, you got your towel rack and a little painting here. I went with all white walls and one tiled wall here where the sink is. I think it looks nice. I love this floor. The floor tiles look unbelievable. I'm getting kind of stuck in the sink here. But yeah, I think it looks... Real oh, I didn't assemble this yet. That's probably pretty important, right? <laughs> Customers are going to come through and be like, Hey, the sink doesn't work. What's going on here? The mirror turns on, by the way. Ah, that's pretty nice. I was thinking of something up here, but you know what? I kind of like the simplicity. Oh, did I... Did I... I did install that, right? 
Yeah, so now I'm, now I'm nervous I didn't install all the things. But anyway, yeah, I love this bathroom. Maybe it's because I had such low expectations for it because it was so tiny. One thing it is missing, though, is a shower. And I was hoping I could do like a, a shower, a separate shower attachment coming out of the wall. But as far as I can tell, I cannot. So um, why does it keep doing that? It's like highlighting that thing. That's making me, it makes me feel like I didn't install it or something properly, but I'm sure it's fine. Anyway, that's the bathroom done. We have one room remaining inside the house right here, this bedroom. I'll do that right now. And then, can I move this further back? Yes, I can. Good. Uh, and then maybe I'll do some backyard stuff. Oh, I think maybe a rug over here would look good too. The backyard, I'm not going to go too crazy with just yet. We want... I the, the time I, um, the one time that I'll go crazy with the backyard is when I have a big one. Although this one is pretty big. Hmm. I do have $13,000 in my bank account to make these changes happen. Is this white paint? I think it is. I think it is. All right, guys. I think I am done. I didn't even think about, um, selling all this stuff until just now when I started recording again. Listen. I, uh, here's the thing. I really, really want, there's a bunch of cups in the front yard and they are like immersing themselves in the grass. I really wanted to do like a very detailed job here on the outside, but I'm kind of excited to try out all these. First of all, I'm not going to paint this house. It's going to sell like this. I don't know if that's going to adversely affect my price, but I like the siding and I refuse to paint this house to make it look like a boring, bland sort of area. Um, I'm not going to do the outside. I really wanted to spend some time in the garden, but I'm very excited to go into the Steam Workshop and get all kinds of downloadables and stuff for this for this game. So we're going to leave this house as is. But let me show you the final bedroom. Oh, by the way, I put like a little rug here. It looks good. This is perfect. And I also don't have a vent for above the stovetop, which is a bad idea. I do have a double oven though here. So that kind of balances things out. Not really. Um, this room is awesome. I left this wall in sort of a bricky sort of tone. I wish there was a bigger mirror. I think there is. I just missed it. Um, then there's the dresser, of course. The rug ties in the wall really well. And then we've got two little paintings here. Then we've got this. This this is more of an edgy room. So think outside of the box. Super edgy, bro. And then we've got like the white lamps. Speaking of edgy. I did put heating in here as well. Guys, I think it's time to sell this house. I really do. I mean, can we do it? It's a decent looking house. It's got everything anybody will ever want. Let's look at this bathroom again. This is a this is a beautiful bathroom, I think. For the space that I had to work with, I think that bathroom is awesome. Let's sell the house. Submit garden for contest. Somebody told me in the comments, oh, a lot of you told me in the comments that you always submit it because even though it costs something, it always improves the sale of your house. So let's go with the, we're definitely the American. Layout, four stars. New record. Oh, Cleanliness is the pluses. New personal record. The value of the house is increased by 0%. Okay. So, that we just wasted $14 for nothing. That's okay. That's okay. Put on the auction. Here we go. 87 that Hello. 90 that Veronica Lipston. The family Johnson. The Smoth family. Dolan Trusk. Raphael Urko. The Jantart family. The house is very clean. The whole house is clean. Very nice. That's the downside? Hold on, I just made $37,000. I bit I bought I bought it for 58. The reno cost is a 1000, that's it. And then the furniture, of course, not cost me an arm and a leg. Furniture is sold, house sale, $37,000 on this house. Is that good? Can I shift? I'm going to try to negotiate with these people, right? Can I click them? Uh okay, so the house there are too many rooms. Okay, come on, Jantart family. Shift and enter is negotiate. Propose to increase payment by, uh, let's see. We want a house sit. Let's make it over a hundred thousand dollar house sale. So let's just increase the payment by another. Let's start at five and see what happens here. Okay. So then, do I just do this? They're thinking about it. Your offer is too low. I can sell you the house for five thousand more. We're sorry, but we can't afford to pay more. Oh, that's a shame. So can we just accept this offer then? From the Jantart family? Okay, fine. We'll accept your offer, Jantart family. Look at the before. Oh, guys. That was a before and after. This house went through a massive change. Look at this. I mean, the outside's nothing to be proud of. But the inside, though, wow. I'm impressed with myself. Boy, my office yard could really, could really use a mowing. 
Eh, all in good time. Okay, let's check it. Look, we have $110,000 to work with now. What kind of a house can we buy for $110,000? Let's go to the browser. 40000 62000 89000 Okay, we got to leave ourselves a little... <gasps> what is this? Oh, and it's all like open concept already? It doesn't even look like it's in that bad of shape. A hidden gem, a cozy house on a small island far out in the ocean. The previous owner is a renowned martial arts master who left... This place to start his own dojo. Guys, are you kidding me? Start his own dojo? Wait a minute. The turtle house? I get it. Um, That is very interesting. What is this? Hacker loft. Oh, this looks terrible. I don't want any part of this. Well, maybe not right now. Oh, I, I thought... But it's okay. It's fine. Okay, these houses are too... Ex I really want the turtle house. We're buying this place. You bought a new house. Do you want to go there? Absolutely. Guys, I'm kind of excited... It's actually on an island. Can I do some gardening? I'm assuming I could do some gardening on this one too. It looks like a small house, which is nice. Not a whole lot of work to do. There's my boat. <laughs> I had to take a boat to this house. What is this? Hole to pick up. What the heck did I just pick up? Okay, we're already removing weeds. What was that that I picked up? This is really weird. It's like I'm playing a different game all of a sudden. What is that? <laughs> I have no idea. I promise I didn't put any um any workshop stuff, Steam Workshop stuff. I didn't install anything yet, so um, this is different. Okay, let's go inside the house. I'm very excited to see what this is all about. It's very pink. I'm definitely going to make house. Make house. Okay, I'm definitely going to paint the outside of it. Guys, this house is like in great shape. Like I can use all these cabinets. I can use this fridge. Oh, there's a basement? Oh, this is where people are sleeping. Okay, look at this basement even is in decent shape. It's got three beds already. I feel like I'm going to make a killing with this place. What is this again? Come here. Be oh, bed. Move out of the way. What are you? I can't even... Can I sell it? I don't think I can sell it. Bed. I just sold the bed. Oh, I'm such an idiot. And I cannot sell this thing. Okay. Well, I think I only wanted two beds down here anyway, right? Maybe like divide it up. Oh, we probably could divide it into three rooms. I don't know. Are the lights even working? There are no lights down here. Okay. Guys, we got a lot of work to do with this one, but not as much as I was expecting. What does this say? To-do list. Eat, sleep, train, find flipper balls, revive Krillin. Now, this is a reference that I am not familiar with, and so I apologize. Let's check out the bathroom. There's another one of these things. Okay. This bathroom looks good. The tub looks good. The sink looks good. It just I feel like it just needs some cleaning up and some... Some painting and stuff. Ooh, hold on. Is this enough space for... I mean, we could make the bathroom bigger. That's for sure. Interesting seating. Uh-huh. Guys, thank you so much for watching this episode. I am pumped to redo the turtle house. If you know what these references are, please let me know. Okay, because I'm not I'm not hip. I'm not hip to the, to the reference game. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. We'll see you in the next one. And thank you for supporting this channel, by the way. I should have mentioned that before. I really appreciate it. This is like a channel where I get to... It's almost like a vacation from the other YouTube stuff, you know? Because the other YouTube stuff, everything's really serious. You know, the, the Minecraft stuff, super serious. Hold to pick up... <gasps> another one. Hold on. Get you out of the way here. Found another one. Uh, yeah, the other stuff is really serious, and it takes me a very, very long time to make every single one of those videos. In this game, I feel like I could just get on here, play for a few hours, just have some fun, and then uh, and then show you guys what I've done. Thank you so much for watching. Please leave a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.